Hey, buddy. Man, that's sweet. Man, that's cool. My grandpa bought it from a guy up the road, and uh, it was, uh, it, this one was black. This car was actually a very rare color. They only made a couple hundred of them. It was a dark purple that looked black. Like black cherry. Yeah, and it was a very rare color. And they only made like 163 of them. And uh, unfortunately, they drove it home, left the top down. We're going to go pull the motor out to rebuild it and let it sit for about 30 years. And then, uh, Man, that joker's clean. How'd they find this? He uh, he is a client. He uh, gives real lessons and some yeah. client's family member had it on the garage, did a garage down in uh, on Arsenal. Yeah. Oh, in the city, city. Yeah. City. Oh yeah. They had a couple cars. And he put a top on it too. The top is in great shape. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's a land. That's what we call a land yacht. That is a straight land yeah. yacht. Period. My '67 Galaxy was longer than this, and it would never be in my garage. <laughs> really? It was. It was almost 20 feet long. That's crazy. I don't know how long this one is. It's about 20 and a half. I think. 21. Man. I was gonna say the standard garages are usually about 20. So. So basically, the back of that is gonna be hanging off of my bed because my bed is only 19. Point six. Wheels, yeah, the both wheels will be on, but that back end definitely gonna be hanging up. Yeah. Um, is that your pilot right there? Yeah, you want to move it? I gotta come in at an angle because honestly, the best way is gonna be just a straight shot. Okay, well, if you wanna, okay. Do you care if he records it with his camera, kind of like me no. pulling it out and stuff? And That'd be all right. right, right on. You got a key for it? No. Uh, but he still got it in neutral and all that. Yeah, he's ready to go. Okay, no problem. That's cool how the grills kind of come in like that. And just yeah, but see it as the double stack headlights like the GTO. Right. And in 1965, Ford did the same thing. My 67 had double stack headlights like that, and everyone goes, "That's a really cool Pontiac." I'm like it's not a Pontiac, it's a Ford, but but Ford stole Pontiac's grill. <laughs> they did the exact same thing. They even had the same trim ring and everything. Wow. Yeah, they're so cool. It's pretty straight, huh? Yeah, it's a really nice car, and it's pretty solid. It's not all rusted out or anything. A lot of cars will rust right along the rocker right here. Yeah. And this one's pretty solid. It's in really good shape, and it looks very original. I mean, look at the interior on it. Wow. The interior yeah, really she's beautiful. Shape. They're not going to have to do a whole lot of crazy stuff to this car. She's almost, almost ready to go. Probably just throw, oh, there's the keys right there on the floor. Okay, we don't probably don't need them. Um, on these years, they, the uh, steering wheels don't lock or anything, so we'll be fine. But right on. Cool. Yeah, very neat car. And if you want to grab your cam, man, we'll get some more shots. Yeah. He was cool with it. Man, I'd love to have this thing. I need to get me another convertible. I haven't had one in a while. So we're here. This is a pretty cool car. Um, man, I would just love to drive this around. I mean, that's crazy. 20 feet long, it barely fits in the garage. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get this loaded once he once he moves his car there. We're gonna figure it all out. Hopefully she rolls nice and easy. All right, let me get in position. All right. All right, one land yacht coming up. Well, I think the best way to do it is to have you hop in and steer while I winch on it. 
probably the easiest and best way. Just because it's tucked in so close to next to that wall right there. Yeah, she's close. Back then cars didn't have power steering. Yeah. Well, that's because their steering wheels were so ginormous. That was the power steering. <laughs> yeah, 23 inch steering wheel on this thing. Yeah, you're gonna hug that rail basically and then we'll straighten it out. If it's over on one side, that's fine. There's a little spider web down here. Yeah, as much as you can. Yeah, it's actually really clean underneath. Okay. You got her in neutral? She's in neutral? Yeah. All right. What's up, buddy? She rolls pretty good. Keep going. Keep coming. That's good, that's good right there. Good. Nope. <laughs> well, she ain't gonna roll up. You're good, just like that. Always double check, make sure the chains are in the slots. Looks like they're in there pretty good. What? Yeah, you're good. You're good. Right. Always grab one of these in case of emergencies. I could just throw it up underneath the rear wheel. Sometimes those hooks pop out. So, okay, straighten out. Straighten out. Yep, there you go. Hit it to the right. That is literally probably a half an inch away from the ground. Straighten out. piece of paper away from there.
Can't throw it in park. So we got her out. Get a good look at her. By the way, somebody's glasses were in here on the deck. Yeah, Thank you, sir. Thank you. Man, this thing is straight. Wow, I can't believe how straight this car is. You can tell this car was garaged for a long time. It hasn't been Still got the plates on it, the antique tag. Yeah, I think these glasses go with the car. Do they? They were sitting in there where they... Hey, yeah, they, the they, stay, floor, they right? stay with the car then. Yeah, it's kind of... Uh, I, I know what you're saying. Man, that's sweet. Right on. So I'll go ahead and finish her strapping in and we'll get it. Yeah, this shit's gonna hang off. Them, them tires are super dry rotted. Yeah, they're probably from the 70s. They <laughs> look like they're from the 70s. Too. So we're good there. These older cars, they got the slots right on the sides right there. Yeah, and the nice thing about these old cars is they usually have good areas to connect to. Oh yeah, it's got a nice little mini slot right there. Yeah, the frame just has surface, it's pretty good. Yeah, it's not all rotted out. It's a very solid car. Yeah. It doesn't have any bundles. Man, they always get lucky on these cars. Man, how come we can't find I know, dude. Donovan's gonna have to start giving me some of these nice cars. Nah, I'm just joking. I'm poor. I can't afford anything like this. Oh. All right, so got it just about strapped in we put a couple extra little straps on it just because it's such a big huge heavy car and i don't want to take no chances so we got all four corners and uh we got the wench line on it aside from the two straps on the back so hopefully she'll be good like that for tow transport and we're gonna get this land yacht over to mr donovan's